This is a historic day for Texas and the state's cannabis program. Where I'm at right now is one of the flower rooms where these plants are being cultivated. Those planning to come to this new dispensary will have the same experience as any typical pharmacy. Staff will be ready to answer questions, give consultations, and other detailed information about their products. Compassionate Cultivation is one of three companies in Texas licensed to grow cannabis that's high in CBD and low in THC, which will not get you high. This is the only product it will be selling and it will only be sold to a very limited group of customers. The only people who can legally get prescriptions for, purchase, or use the oil are those with uncontrollable epilepsy. In order to get the oil, patients must visit one of 17 state-approved doctors before visiting the dispensary or arranging for delivery from one of the state's licensed CBD oil producers. Morris Stenton is the CEO of Compassionate Cultivation, and he tells us he's happy Texas has finally allowed some movement on medical marijuana. It's a struggle. I mean, for these families that, you know, deal with this issue, this isn't, you know, a, a business challenge that they face. I mean, this is a this is a mighty, mighty battle that they're facing and that they deal with daily and multiple times a day. I mean, on a good day, some of these kids may have, you know, seizures you can count on one hand and then on bad days you lose count. Yeah. And yet here they are, they're waiting for this medicine to be available. So for us, it became more personal, you know, because we know these folks now. They're our neighbors, they're our friends, they're Texans like us and we want to do what we can to help them. These plants you're looking at right now have been growing for a little over two months. Now from seed to sale, it takes about four months. This dispensary is open Thursday through Saturday from 10 a.m. until 7 p.m. They also make appointments. Now for $25, they will deliver anywhere in the state of Texas, but that is if you have a medical marijuana prescription. Reporting in Manshack, Jacqueline Sarkeesian, Fox 7 Austin News.